So that time of year has come again, wherein I must get rid of the puff. So I usually do this in like October, which is the stupidest time to just, oh yeah, check it out, looking good. I think I'll just leave it just like that. October is the stupidest time of year to uh, cut off all your hair because it's um, right before it gets cold. And I fucking hate the cold, but for some reason, it always comes around that like I want to, I get, I get this desire to cut off all my hair right about October. So I'm gonna try and correct that by doing it right now, um, just before summer. So hopefully uh, I'll have done this already. I can grow it out throughout the summer and not worry about it uh, come winter time. I used to be really vain about my hair, but I grew out of that. And I also used to go to like, you know, professional barbers and stuff, but who the hell goes to those anymore? I, I mean, technically I can afford them, but uh, but why when I already have clippers at home? These were given to me by a very dear friend who I'm going to England to see get married for a second time. Uh, I mean, he's getting married for a second time to the same person because the first time it was for basically for him to be able to stay in England because he's an American. And this time it's so that, you know, we can have a big party. They're not great at uh, cutting my hair since I have really thin hair, but uh, got the job done last time and it seems to be doing okay this time. Ow. Sometimes it just tears my hair out though, and that's not very fun. Ow. I like when it gets bogged down, it's like uh, cutting through a freaking tree trunk. So I have to be careful these days, because uh, it used to be that you could cut your hair without consequence, but when you start having children, um, they get used to you looking a certain way, and then they uh, sometimes freak out when you don't look that way anymore. Although I think she's old enough now that it probably won't matter. This isn't nearly as easy as they made it look like in G.I. Jane. I'm using a viewfinder as the uh, as my mirror. So yeah, as you can see, maybe you can't see. Um, you see the scar that runs across my head? Yeah, that's what that's from. Or, you know, is related to that. Boy, I hope my microphone's on. Okay, good. <laughs> that would've sucked. Do a little clean up and it'll be good. Hair cut. Do you cut your own hair? And if so, how do you cut it? Do you just kind of shave it all off or do you like style it for real style? How much are you willing to pay for a haircut? Because I think the maximum I'm ever willing to pay for a haircut is like 15 bucks if I've got to like go get a job somewhere. So like I got to have like a nice looking haircut. Uh, I'll pay like 15 bucks max. And he better also trim the beard at that point. Uh, but that's about as much as I'll pay. So. Generally, I'll just do it for free for myself, though. So let me know in the comments, what do you do for haircuts?